Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Gorgeous Lace. If you want to see how I achieve this look, keep on watching. All right, so I'm going to start off with my Josie Marin 100% Argan Oil. And I'm going to apply that all over my face to give it a lot of moisture. Then I'm going to take my YSL Foundation Primer and I'm going to apply this all over my face. Using two beauty blenders and one small one, I'm going to either use my NARS or my Urban Decay All Nighter Foundation. I can't decide. Oh, 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 All Nighter. I'm going to apply that on the bottom of my wet beauty blender and I'm going to basically apply that all over my face to give my face a full coverage. You always want to use a damp beauty blender because it's going to give you a flawless foundation application. Then I'm going to take my ultimate favorite concealer from NARS and the color Macadamia and apply that on my high points. Then I'm going to take my Anastasia brow brush and I'm going to brush up my eyebrows and use my Kaboom Eyebrow Pomade from Benefit. I absolutely love this eyebrow pomade from Benefit. It's called Cabral and it's in the color 5. It's a cream gel brow brush and it comes with this little brush that's connected to it. This is amazing. I like brushing my eyebrow in between like filling in my eyebrow because it just makes it more natural looking. So I brush and then I fill in, I brush and then fill in. Then I'm going to go back in with my NARS concealer and clean up that brow. Using my damp beauty blender, I'm going to go in and blend out my concealer. You never want to rub the concealer in, you always want to blot it. Using my NARS concealer in the color Cocoa, I'm going to contour my face and sculpt it. This will basically allow my face to seem slimmer and more toned. Using my IT Cosmetic brushes, I'm going to use the fluffiest brush and I'm going to apply a powder on my cream contour. Whenever you are applying cream contour, you want to set that cream contour with a powder. Using my Urban Decay Naked Ultimate Basics palette, I'm going to take the lightest color, which is Glow, and I'm going to apply that on my lid as my transition color. The next color I'm going to take is the Extra Bitter and I'm going to apply that on my lid as well as my crease. Then I'm going to take the lightest color, glow again, and I'm going to apply that on my lid to clean it up. Next, I'm going to take my liquid liner from Stila, and I'm basically going to apply a nice, sharp wing. Just going to apply a nice, thin layer, and then I'm going to take the darkest color and put it under my eyes. Next, using the Benefit Their Real Lash Primer, then I'm going to take the Too Faced Better Than Sex and use that to apply on my eyelashes. Then I'm going to take my MAC lashes and apply these. They are so pretty. Look. Then I'm going to take my Laura Mercier translucent powder and I'm going to apply that on my concealer areas. This is called baking. It's going to give me a more chiseled look. Whoop. Whoop. Hey. Look at Sasha. Everyone say hi. She is my baby. I had her since three months old and she loves me and I love her too. Look at that shrinkage. All right, I'm being silly now. All right, so next I'm gonna dust off that powder. Now taking my Anastasia Glow Kit and my IT Cosmetics Fan Brush, I'm using the color White Sand. Applying that on my cheekbones, down my nose and top of my lip. And then I'm taking my Champagne Pop from Becca Cosmetics. Using my NARS blush in color Orgasm, I'm going to apply that between my contour and my highlight to give color. Just look at that glow. Next, I'm going to go in using my Chestnut Lip Liner from MAC Cosmetics and outline my lips. Then I'm going to take my Smashbox Liquid Matte Lipstick in the color True Grit. It's a really pretty brown color. Now it's time to untwist my hair. So I just did a little twist out using, I don't remember the product, but I'll link it below. But I just basically twisted it before I did my makeup. It dried up a little bit and then basically just gonna unravel it, fluff it out, 
and voila girl I'm popping well this is the final look guys thank you guys so much for watching and tuning into my channel please let me know what you think give me any tips advice let me know if you want to see anything else that I did or let me know if you want a video on this look for my hair Thank you guys for so much for subbing to me. You guys are amazing and I will see you soon.